Digital Crafts. That's the old logo. I got the shirt two years ago, June 2018. I was with my in-laws in, -laws in uh, Alabama. My wife and four kids and I were all staying in their guest bedroom. I had no income. We were on food stamps. I was having anxiety attacks. It was really bad. I was buying and selling like antiques and stuff. Totally not tech related, right? I was trying to apply to jobs. I don't have a, I don't have a, any, I don't have a bachelor's degree. I have zero college credits. I never went to college, okay? And I, I mean, what, what the heck was I doing? I don't know. But anyways, no college credits. I needed to switch careers. I was looking into software engineering. The thing with software engineering is that it's based on what you can do, okay? I mean, some companies are still old fashioned and want a CS degree. Most of the smart ones are like, no, you know what? If you can code, we'll hire you and we'll pay you a ton of money. So I was like, okay, great. So I was trying to teach myself online. I was going through all these you know, tutorials and things while I was sitting in a coffee shop having panic attacks. Some people can do that. If you can do it, awesome. You are amazing, do it, go for it. But I couldn't do it, I couldn't do it. I knew I needed humans, I needed people. And I was looking at boot camps and digital crafts stuck out to me. They were relatively close by in Atlanta. They were in a, you know, a, a larger city that had you know, a lot of tech opportunities. I went and checked them out, I talked to the guys. They, they seemed legit, they seemed cool. And the other cool thing is like I was gonna do the full-time program and they had four months in their curriculum as opposed to usually it's like three months for a lot of these places. And I, and I knew I needed that extra month. So I was like, yes, sign me up. I didn't have time to do the pre-work. I was just going in, just, just like I had to happen. So I left my family with my uh, the in-laws. I rented a little place here in Atlanta. I moved to Atlanta. And for the next four months, I was coding, 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 coding. Their curriculum was cutting edge. Okay, this is the thing with the boot camp, right? They can adapt. As the industry changes, which it does all the time, super quickly, they can adapt. You can go in there for four months and they will give you the rundown for what companies are hiring for right now. As soon as you leave, you'll be able to get a job based on the knowledge you get, okay? So that's, that really appealed to me and it, and it was true, right? Um, a lot of my uh, classmates and me like, got a front end job uh, doing React, but we also got, you know, we learned about Node, we learned about uh, SQL, we did databases, APIs, we built full stack applications as teams, we worked together, we used real world tools like Git and GitHub, Trello. Like a few weeks after I got, after I graduated, I got my first job. It was an entrepreneur, he was at the Atlanta Tech Village. Anyways, long story, he needed someone doing React, he hired me, and I worked for him for like three months. Meanwhile, applying like crazy to, you know, all sorts of jobs, going to meetups, everything. 200 rejections, like three interviews, one offer. And that's the amazing company I've been with for the past year and a half. And yeah, so Digital Crafts is amazing. Digital Crafts is the real deal. If you're thinking about getting into software engineering, definitely consider Digital Crafts. They are super cool people. I love them. I love what they're doing. So just wherever you are in your journey, I wish you all the best.